Grand Valley State University and regional partners held a beach cleanup today at Pier Marquette Beach. Well, volunteers collected large pieces of trash and plastics. It was new technology that stole the show. News 8's Megan Bunchman has our story. Megan? An eco-friendly robot is changing the game in beach cleanups and the collection of plastics in the Great Lakes. Meet Bebot, a lean green cleaning machine. Literally. It's a, a unique approach compared to sort of the standard municipal beach cleaning equipment that re removes large particles, larger pieces like bottles and so on. This will get those smaller fragments down to three centimeters that continue to be uh, shattered, fractionated. They get smaller and smaller. The new technology debuted at Pierre Marquette Beach today as volunteers from Meyer, GVSU, and the Great Lakes Plastic Cleanup handpicked a larger litter and debris from the sandy shoreline. Bebot, a remote control trash collector, specifically targets smaller debris that's not always visible to the eye, known as microplastics. If this teeny trash isn't collected, scientists and Great Lakes water experts say the impact on the ecosystem is grave. The microplastics, as they get down into the smaller size ranges, start to mimic the normal food particles that, say, juvenile fish would eat or smaller species of fish. Not to mention the drinking water of people both in Muskegon. We are talking about drinking water here in the Great Lakes, and the, the Muskegon City uh, water filtration plant is directly behind us, um, and that provides the water for most of the residents here in the southern part of Muskegon County. And across several Midwestern states. Over 40 million people get their drinking water from the Great Lakes, so super important to make sure that, you know, the Great Lakes are healthy. Data is collected after every cleanup in Sandy Track, which helps the Council of the Great Lakes region understand the lake's litter landscape. Yeah, that's a plastic bag. Yeah. So while volunteer beach cleanups aren't going away anytime soon, Bebot may take a big bite out of microplastics. Bebot will be used three times a week at a variety of beaches across West Michigan throughout the summer, and the robot and its technology was made possible after a large donation from Meyer. Emily.